morning right now. One lane of 45 still shut down at this hour after a deadly wreck. It's happening on the inner loop near Mint Hill, close to the Lawyers Road exit, and that's where NBC Charlotte's Ruby Durham is. So, Ruby, what are you learning about this? Well, Carolyn, I'm working to learn the person's identity and what played as a factor in this crash, but I want to take you out on scene. I'm currently standing on the bridge on Lawyers Road looking down at I-45. You can see multiple first responders here. They're walking around with flashlights, canvassing the area. There's a tow truck here on scene, and you can see the car that was involved in the crash. Authorities say the single car crash happened around 3 this morning. I'm told the car was driving on the interstate when it hit the median guardrail and overturned. Right now, authorities are blocking a portion of the 45 inner loop while they look into more what happened here overnight. It is still not clear on when the section will reopen, but if you take a look here at traffic, you can see it's pretty much bumper to bumper. Cars are slowing down as they approach the scene. So let's get over to Rachel Roller in the traffic center for your alternate routes. Yeah, Ruby, the good news there on that scene is that that one lane is still allowing cars through, but very busy, a bad start to the Monday morning, unfortunately, as well. You can see 485, it's right where Ruby was mentioning, exit 47, which is going to be Lawyer's Road for you now. The backups aren't really reflecting in our system just yet. I think that's because you can still get through there. I'll let you know when we're starting to see those delays, though, coming through, of course, with the rush hour starting to get here. Now